If you live in a community long enough, you learn that there are certain athletes that become part of the fabric of their community. And there's no question that here, former Cardinals receiver Larry Fitzgerald is one of them. Fitz was not only a superstar on the field, but maybe more importantly, off of it as well. And now he's getting ready for a passion project this weekend that'll bring hundreds of golfers to the links, all to raise money for a cause near and dear to his heart, the American Cancer Society. If I were in your shoes, that would mean so much to me. It isn't just about what the athlete does on the field. Mm -hmm. it's, it's how they ingrain themselves in the community and how they helped lift their community. And, and that, I'm sure, knowing you as well as I do, is so important to you. Well, absolutely. That's, that has to be a part of your ethos. I mean, you're, you're brought to the city, right? I, I came to Arizona because I was brought here for work. But, you know, I live here. My, my children were born here. Um, you know, this is this is home for me now. And, you know, when, when you're able to stay in a, a certain place for that long, it's your responsibility to really dig in and, and dive into the community. And that's why I'm so ex excited about our, our relationship with the American Cancer Society, you know, joining forces with them. Um, you know, they, they raise hundreds of millions of dollars that really goes to fighting a, a disease that has devastated my family, you know, took my mother's life, um, has affected two of my mother's sisters. You know, it, it's really touched my life in, in a way that I wish it hadn't, but it's opened my eyes to how devastating it can be and, and, it's, and it's made me more aware and it's made me more proactive. And also, you know, my hands are, are firmly on the wheel um, of doing everything I can in my power to eradicate this disease. Larry, we were talking about your involvement uh, with the American Cancer Society because of the unfortunate situation with your mom. And talk about the, the goal and the mission uh, of your involvement here. Well, I mean, initially when, we, when I started the foundation, all I could ever think about is, you know, the pain that my family felt and how I could alleviate that stress on people that, especially in my community. And so um, when we launched it, you know, in, in 2005, I would have never envisioned that we would get to the place where we are now, where we're teaming with, you know, the American Cancer Society, you know, talking the largest, uh, one of the largest organizations in, in our country um, that has reached that is unparalleled to be working with my foundation. It's something that I was, I was elated about when the opportunity presented itself and, and finding new and creative ways where we can work together is one of the reasons we launched uh, on, on the 1st of November our Breast Believe campaign, which is an evergreen uh, campaign where we're going to, you know, provide, you know, mobile mammograms and, and things of that nature for people who are in need. And, um, you know, that's something that uh, I'm, I'm extremely passionate about and I'm really looking forward to, you know, getting, getting my feet on the ground and um, getting to work. And I know because we talk about it all the time here on 12, the importance of women to be their own advocates and do a breast self-exam monthly mm -hmm. and, and to detect things that way. And, and so many women are saved mm -hmm. because they detect something on their own. It is extremely important to, to do self-evaluation, but not only for, for women to do it, but for men as well. Um, you know, breast cancer in men has really risen over the last few years. And so, you know, men, if you're listening, I, I would encourage you to do the same thing. How are the plans for the uh, tournament coming? They're coming out great. You know, we're, we're going to be having the tournament up the 17th and 18th of November uh, at, at Western Carolina Golf Course there. And, uh, you know, we, we're finalizing sponsorships and, and celebrities playing in, in, in an event. So, um, you know, if there's any interest, you can go to LarryFitzgeraldFoundation.org for more information. Or if you want to participate as a foursome or individual, we'd love to have you.